How's it everyone? Welcome to a new segment on Open Court called the Court Checklist. So on the Court Checklist, I aim to just talk about some general topics about tennis, about tennis gear, about the game of tennis, um, answer some of the questions that you guys might have that I get often to help you guys understand the game better as well as the gear better so that you can hopefully choose the gear that's best suited for you and to help improve your game. So a question that I've been asked often is, hey Kent, why do you string your racket, why do you string the mains and the crosses at different tensions? So if you guys have watched some of my videos, you know that I like to string my crosses about two pounds looser than my mains. So for example, in this Head Speed Pro, I have the mains strung at 52 pounds and the crosses strung at 50 pounds. What's the purpose of this? Why do I string at different tension? Most people who string different tension, it's because they're using a hybrid. They have two different strings. So usually when you hybrid, you string the softer string at a tighter tension and the stiffer string in a looser tension. That way it evens out the firmness of the string bed a little bit. Obviously, if you have one string that's soft and one string that's hard and you string them at the same tension, the string bed is not gonna feel as consistent. So if you want a consistent stiffness in feel, you want to adjust your tension accordingly so you get a consistent feel. But maybe you guys have noticed this is not a hybrid. This is just the same string on the mains and crosses. So what's the purpose of stringing the mains tighter than the crosses? Well, by stringing the crosses looser, it actually allows the main strings to slide and snap back, you see that, into place. It slides a little bit more and that way it generates a little bit more snap back to get a little bit extra spin. Now, I know a lot of people don't really believe in this. I didn't really believe in it either, but I do feel that it does help my spin a little bit, especially in a string pattern like this 1820 that I could use all the help I can get in terms of spin. I'm willing to try it. So that's why, that's the reason why, even though I use the same string in the mains and crosses, I string the crosses two pounds looser than the mains. It's just to help facilitate a little bit more snapback and to generate a little bit more extra spin. So I hope this video was helpful for you. I hope that answered your question as to why I string different tension in the mains and crosses, as well as why most people out there do that. If you guys have any more questions, feel free to send it to Open Court. I'll try and get to you guys as soon as possible, or maybe I'll answer your questions directly on a future segment of the court checklist. Thank you for watching.